<laughs> hey guys and welcome to the video and I hope that you are feeling awesome. Alright guys, I was going to go out for an early morning walk and uh, hopefully get some pictures but unfortunately we've had some rain this morning so I've had uh, quite a few hours indoors sorting out my PC. Now, I have to confess, I try to keep as many of the clips that I create as possible, right? But sometimes I overkeep clips. Now, when I say that is, I've kept some clips on my PC from all of my time travel videos. I've kept them. And I thought, do I really need to keep hold of them? I've uploaded them to YouTube. They're on Facebook. So, you know, why do I need them? However, guys, as I mentioned about the horrible weather this morning, I'm hoping later on, guys, it's going to clear up because I looked at the weather report and it looks like it's going to be absolutely awesome. So I may go out later on and do a little bit of ecotherapy walking and take some pictures, you know, and upload those to the page. However, guys, when I've been in the garden, I've been looking around whilst I've been talking to you and I've noticed like there's a load of birds flying around. So I'm going to try my best, guys, to see if I can capture some of these birds flying around for you guys to see so what I'm going to do is go down to the bottom of the garden and then look back because wow there's loads on the aerial here crikey guys whoa look at them go whoa there's more wow crikey that was definitely uh, worth the wait there guys and uh, I would love to know what um, type of birds they were. Wow, guys, the sky this morning is looking so beautiful. And I must admit, I really wished I was uh, out doing the uh, video of it because it was so fantastic earlier, honestly, it was. Now, in the next couple of weeks, guys, no word of a lie, I haven't got a clue what I'm going to be able to record for you because I've got two weeks worth of literally back-to-back -back shifts and let's just say I don't know if I'm going to have enough time to spend with Yvonne letting him get the camera out and record things for you guys. So let's just say, I'm, you know, fingers crossed, I hope that I'm going to be able to give you some content. Hello, da. Hello, da. <laughs> well, guys, I can honestly say I've had a great first shift. Yvonne's about to start her shift and uh, the weather is looking absolutely awesome but unfortunately you feel this way don't you when the weather's great we always got to work yes it's so frustrating well anyways farewell goodbye Bye, enjoy guys. your shift today <laughs> wow the sky is absolutely crap well i am now finished for today i have done loads of different you know jobs today and i cannot even think about what i've done right now my mind's just gone blank and I'm about to go and meet up with Yvonne and she's sat in the sky right now. Serious face! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, well I think I've just woke her up. But anyways, I'm about to go in now and uh, finish and then I'm going to come out and uh, spend some time with Yvonne and then head home. Well guys, we are on our way home and Yvonne's um, being a camera woman here. We have some geese. Oh, wow, there's loads of them. The problem is guys, with the geese that cross there, it causes a lot of problems with the traffic. And it can be quite scary. But anyways, we are now on our way home. Yes. One thing I did discover when I was uh, on my way into work today, I seen a rabbit. Now, this sounds crazy to you, I know, but literally for a couple of months now, I've seen one rabbit on the uh, power station road. So I thought, do you know what? I'm gonna go and see if I can see it again today. And if I can, how cool would it be to show you guys? There it is, guys. Told you there was a rabbit. Where did it go? It was like it just disappeared into this bush. And it went into this area here, guys. Well, anyways, whilst we're over this side, 
let's have a look at the brook. Crikey, this has uh, grown since the last time I've been here. You can't even see the water. Just about see it there. All that darkness there, guys, is the water. Last time I seen this area, guys, no word of a lie, I was in two minds whether or not I can get into this area here. But looking at it now, I'm like, huh, hell no. Well, anyways, I'm back to uh, walk back towards Tesco's now and uh, start my shift for the day. Wow, guys, the sky is not cleared up. I am a bit disappointed, to be honest, because I was hoping that it might have cleared up a little bit. But, you know, I suppose these things you can't um, control. I will say one thing. I am absolutely looking forward to when I get my drone fixed because I am determined, guys, to get it fixed. I want it back. You know, I've had so many ideas I wanted to use for a drone and uh, I need it. I just need it, guys. The sky looks very, very dark right now and it looks like it's going to start peeing it down. To be truthfully honest, I don't know about you guys, but what I absolutely love about the rain is when you're indoors and you don't have to go outside in it and you can watch it you can see it go down the window for me it's just absolutely perfect but anyways i've just got back from work and i've got to confess this week i had so much overtime to do that i literally haven't had the chance to take you guys out on a bit of ecotherapy but you know sometimes you have to make a decision whether or not to you know do things and such but today I want to make the new Lego model that Yvonne got me for Father's Day. And what I thought was I'll share a time lapse of me making it for you guys to see. Well, anyways, I'm about to uh, jump in the bath now and get myself all freshened up and um, enjoy the rest of my evening. Hello, how you doing? You all right? No, you. You? Which one of you am I talking to? You or you? <laughs> but anyway guys I'm now done having my wash but I will be honest about something guys I am looking forward to making this Lego model well this is the model that I'm building today guys and I can't wait to uh, get this built however I'm kind of having this collection of these small cars so I'll show you the rest now not a lot of them but a little display of them there so yeah guys once I make that model I'm going to have to find some space to put that one but yeah, anyways, let's crack on and make this model. guys i am so pleased i got this model made and to be truthfully honest it didn't take me that long either but i will confess one thing i don't like about when it comes to building these types of models is they require you to put a lot of stickers on them like there's been loads of stickers i've had to put on this one why can't lego sort of laser the design onto these pieces here or would that cost them a lot of money in order to have i don't know specialized equipment set up for just that particular model not too sure guys however guys i haven't even had my dinner yet and i'm waiting on yvonne's uh, phone call because she's uh gonna be on going on her break pretty much soon because it's nice to uh have a little chat with her because unfortunately i didn't really get much chance to speak to her today because um, doing an early start on a Saturday morning, I barely even get a chance to see her in the afternoon before she gets to start. So today I made sure I stayed at work for an extra like 20 to 30 odd minutes so I could spend a little bit of time with her. And, you know, you've got to spend time with those, you know, you love, don't you? But anyway, speaking of time, I best get cracking and have my dinner and uh, look forward to Yvonne's call. Ew, what delightful day we've got for weather, guys. Wow, guys, it looks like the forecast was correct for today because uh, it said it was supposed to be rainy and absolutely horrible. For once, I was hoping for it to be wrong because it'd be nice to wake up with a bit of sunshine. <laughs> but unfortunately, just can't. Why are you even outside? What'd you do? Hey? Meh. Meh. Well, anyways, I'm waiting for Yvonne to finish getting herself ready. 
and then me and her has got to go off to work and to be truthfully honest I can't wait to get today's shift out of way with because later on tonight I'm looking forward to literally flopping however guys last night I was able to have a nice early night and I didn't wake up till like going past seven o'clock this morning so I've had plenty of sleep I just don't feel like I have <laughs> Hello there, Blurry. Hello. <laughs> you actually just went blurry as well. Ah, <laughs> now she's finally got downstairs, we can actually go. Wow, guys, I can't believe how quick the weather has changed today. It was nice to call in the store, but as soon as you step outside, bang, let's have some sweat on that head. <laughs> well, I'm just trying to get everything organized here. Yvonne is just literally going to clock out now. And then she's going to be meeting us outside. And to be truthful on this, I cannot wait to get home and chill. Yvonne is now here and I must admit, we are both absolutely knackered today. It has been that busy in the store. I don't know, but has it been busy on checkouts? Yes. It has been busy? Yes. Good, because it's been busy on the aisles, trust me. We were just saying about, you know, how crazy times have got that, you know, on a Sunday, people are shopping more and more on a Sunday than they are during the week. It's quite fascinating to see differences in, you know, people's shopping patterns. I don't know. We're just weird, aren't we, really? We just work it. We work it. We work it. Work it, work it, work it. So people shop it. We work it. <laughs> well, anyway, guys, we're now going to get home and uh, sit down and flop for a bit. Well, hello there. Look at this homecoming. Hello there, boyo. Hello. What do we. Oh, that is so cute. Oh, I love their little tickets. Now, that, guys, was absolutely perfect. And it's very rare that all three of them are waiting for us when we get home. Wow, guys, I can honestly say the sky is absolutely beautiful. What do you reckon? I think it is, yes. It's fantastic. And apparently next week, guys, we are in for some big amount of heat. So uh, let's just say get those cold covers ready, get those ice packs made, and especially keep yourself hydrated. But anyways, unfortunately, this is where we're going to have to love and leave you for this weekly vlog. So both me and Yvonne want to say a huge thank you for coming by. It means the world to us. And Always, guys, remember to do your best to stay positive and screw all those negatives. Oh, yeah, baby. And we'll see you on the next one. All right. Bye, bye, bye. bye. bye.